Hello and welcome back to Cinebolt. In this video, we are going to take a look at the top new releases on Max in March 2024. For the full list of everything coming to Max this month, be sure to check the top pinned comment of this video. But without further ado, let's start with all the good stuff releasing on the 1st. There are a number of great movies dropping on the 1st, and one of them is 127 Hours. This is a 2010 biographical survival drama that tells the story of Aaron Ralston, an adventurous mountaineer who gets trapped by a boulder in a remote Utah canyon. The film chronicles his 127-hour ordeal as he endures the physical and mental strain of being pinned down. The film is directed by Danny Boyle and is based on Ralston's autobiography, Between a Rock and a Hard Place. Next is 2015's The Revenant. This is a harsh tale of survival and revenge set in 1820s American wilderness and follows frontiersman Hugh Glass, who is mauled by a bear and left for dead by his own team. Fueled by grief and vengeance, Glass embarks on a brutal journey through the unforgiving landscape, determined to survive and confront his betrayer. Directed by Alejandro G. Iñárritu, the film won three Oscars, including for Best Director and Best Actor for DiCaprio, and is known for its stunning visuals, natural light filming techniques, and powerful performances by both DiCaprio and Hardy. Another great western to check out on the first is The Ballad of Lefty Brown, which is a revenge western following Lefty Brown, a grizzled cowboy played by Bill Pullman. Lefty's world is turned upside down after his longtime partner is murdered, but grief and a thirst for justice propel him on a dangerous quest to find his friend's killer. Next is The Green Knight, a fantasy reimagining of the classic Arthurian legend of Sir Gawain. Directed by David Lowery, the film stars Dev Patel as Gawain, King Arthur's reckless nephew, who accepts a challenge from the mysterious Green Knight, setting him off on a perilous journey where he faces tests of courage, temptation, and self-discovery. Other amazing movies releasing on the first includes Deadpool, the Ocean's Eleven movie collection, including the 1960s original, 2008's Rambo, and 2014's Godzilla and Godzilla King of the Monsters. Premiering on the third is the new HBO original miniseries, The Regime. This brand new miniseries takes a darkly comedic swipe at the world of authoritarianism and delves into the inner workings of a crumbling, unnamed European dictatorship, where Chancellor Elena Vernum, played by Kate Winslet, reigns with an increasingly iron fist, but as her grip on power loosens due to paranoia and isolation, she forms an unorthodox bond with a volatile soldier named Herbert Zubak. Now if you weren't able to catch the new Wonka movie starring Timothée Chalamet in theaters, the sugary sweet musical is going to hit max on March 8th. Also, another sort of sugary bittersweet musical in the form A Star Is Born, starring Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga, will also be available to stream on March 8th. Releasing on the 12th is The Lionheart, which is a HBO Max original documentary about the life of two-time Indianapolis 500 winner Dan Weldon. The film will also focus on Weldon's two sons, as they follow in their father's footsteps into the world of racing over a decade after his death. Then on the 14th is Girls on the Bus. This is an American political show that follows four female journalists on the campaign trail covering a group of flawed presidential candidates. As they navigate the demanding world of political reporting, they also grapple with their personal lives, forming friendships, finding love, and potentially uncovering a scandal that could upend the entire election and even democracy itself. The series is inspired by the 2018 memoir, Chasing Hillary, by journalist Amy Chozik, who co-created the show alongside Julie Pleck. Then on the 15th is Dream Scenario. It is a comedic sci-fi fantasy film that stars Nicolas Cage as an ordinary man who becomes a celebrity when he inexplicably starts appearing in millions of people's dreams. At first, it's all fun and games, but when the dream world takes a dark turn, he has to deal with the bizarre consequences of his newfound fame. The film explores themes of normalcy, the price of fame, and maybe even the nature of dreams themselves. Alright, that it for this video, and thank you very much for watching. If you found the video helpful, then leave a like and comment your favorite movies or series that you would like to watch from this list.